All right, guys, before we get started on how to increase the storage capacity of your Amazon Fire TV or Fire Cube, uh, I just want to talk a little bit about the drawings that we're doing at the end of the month, okay? So we're going to be doing a drawing for a brand new Fire Stick, the brand new Fire TV Cube, and we're also doing a drawing on the sound Pete's headphones that I talked about in one of my previous videos. We're going to go ahead and give away one of each of those. All you need to do guys is hit that thumbs up, which tells me that you like my videos and comment something on the video uh, that you'd like to see possibly in the future uh, on one of my videos. Okay. I'm going to compile all the lists. I've got over 50,000 comments on my videos. You can comment on more than one video. You can like more than one video it gives you additional entries. Every time a video hits a thousand likes, a thousand thumbs up, I do a drawing for another one of these devices. Okay, guys. So we'll be doing those drawings at the end of the month. So make sure you have the notifications turned on. I only keep those prize videos up for 48 hours. I don't want it to get confused with other prize videos in the future. So make sure that you have notifications turned on. Okay. So let's get right to how to increase storage on your Amazon Fire Stick or Cube. All right, guys, what you're going to need is an OTG adapter. It looks just like this, okay? I'm going to put the, a link in the description on where you can find one of these OTG adapters. They're very, very, very affordable. In fact, you can get a two-pack for under $8 free shipping. So uh, I just wanted to share with you what you're going to need first. Okay, so this is what you're going to need. And how it works, guys, is you're going to take your fire stick, just like this, just a little stick. It also works with the cube, but I'm gonna show you uh, on a fire stick how to do it. You're going to remove the cord, the little micro USB that plugs into here. You're gonna remove that. You're going to plug the adapter into that same spot, okay? Just like that. Now you're gonna take this and you're gonna plug it into this end on the adapter okay just like that so now you're going to plug this into your tv you're going to have your normal cord that goes into the wall or your tv if it has enough power on your tv to power your fire stick and then you'll have this extra little plug so this is where it comes in handy okay guys so let's just say you have a little thumb drive just a small thumb drive four gigs i think this is a 16 gig something small maybe 32 but regardless you're going to take this little thumb drive and you're going to plug it in just like that. All right. I'll put illustrations on the screen so it's a little bit easier to see. But now you've got all this extra stuff attached, but you just increased double, triple, quadrupled your storage on your Fire Stick. Now, if you want to take it one step further, and this is what we do because we like to download programming on to separate devices, okay? we That's what we like to do, and I'm gonna show you how to do that because a 32 gig thumb drive is only gonna hold so many movies or TV shows or whatever while you're, while you're on the road to watch. Another option besides the thumb drive, go ahead and unplug that. Why not get one of these? Guys, this is a two terabyte drive. It works just the same. You plug it right into your USB a OTG adapter and now you have this okay now this might be a little heavy for your TV depending on what you have it set on so it may be a temporary thing that you do to plug in and transfer data uh, you can put programs on here all kinds of things just to take it off of your fire stick because there's only six or eight gigs depending on the fire stick you have available on your little stick so that's where this this is two terabytes you could put a ton of stuff on this drive right here guys just wanted to share that with you um, on how to hook it up i know it's a lot of cords it looks like it's getting rigged a, a kind of a strange way but i promise you it is very very simple and very affordable to do it again you can get two of these for under eight dollars they're like pretty inexpensive and and it's cool you can use these with with uh your Super NES, you can do it with uh, regular Nintendos, you can uh, to sideload games, you can use it on your Android devices as well. It's a really cool little device, a little adapter, and it works really good with Amazon Fire TV. So let's go ahead and head over to the TV 
and let's see how you can take files and transfer them and download them and so forth. Let's do that now. All right, guys, got you in on the screen here. So now that we have it plugged into our TV with our USB drive, the next question is how do we get the movies or TV shows or whatever it is we downloaded, apps, whatever it is, how do we get that then on the USB drive to free up space. You can keep it plugged in at all times or unplug it. That's up to you. Uh, that way you can access the information. But if you're, if you want to go ahead and transfer a movie to your USB drive to take with you, this is how you're going to do it. Okay. So the first thing you're going to want to do is make sure you have a program called ES Explorer. Now, ES Explorer, all you need to do to get that is go over to the hourglass and type in ES File Explorer, okay? Looks just like this, it's easy to download. Just click on it, go ahead and do the download. I know a lot of you already have this if you've watched some of our previous videos, but it looks just like that. Uh, once you open ES Explorer, it'll look just like this, okay? So as you can see, and it may take a second or two to analyze your second drive. You can see the internal storage uh, available, 78% is used on that internal storage, just from apps alone. Can you imagine if I was to put movies on there? You couldn't even do one movie on your internal storage. Maybe a small TV show, if anything, and then it's gonna slow it down. So this is where it comes in handy, guys. Go ahead and it, right below the internal storage, you'll see the USB OTG. That is your secondary drive now. So in this case, it's a 16 gigabyte thumb drive that I have plugged into here. You can go all the way up to two terabyte drives uh, on here as well. So you can really have a lot of stuff downloaded if you like. But uh, let's just use this one for an example. Now the question is, how do you get the media off of your Fire Stick and then onto your USB drive. So this is where you're gonna use it inside of ES File Explorer. So what you're gonna to wanna to do is you're gonna to wanna to go over to the left. So if you go to the left, it looks like this. Head down to download, okay? This is everything you've downloaded onto your device. So locally, uh, the only thing I have on here right now is the TTV app that I downloaded. Uh, let's go ahead and move it over to the thumb drive. It does take up a lot of space. And let's see what kind of difference that makes on our internal drive. So in order to do that, just hold down on the, the select button. Select button is this middle button right here. Just hold down for a few seconds and it will check mark. Okay, once you do that, go ahead and scroll to the bottom where it says cut. Okay, go ahead and cut. Now head over to the left side and you're gonna go down to your drive, your USB OTG drive. Go ahead and click on that. Can you see that on the bottom left? I know the screen's a little bit blurry. That's a little bit better. Okay, so on the bottom left, go ahead. Once again, you hit cut, go to OTG USB and open it up. Okay, now that you've opened it, uh, you can create a new file, which I did for Fire Stick if you want to, uh, or you could just put it here anywhere and paste it. But let's go ahead and open up file, and then you're gonna head over to paste. And it has transferred over to your drive. So there you go. So now if you go back to downloads, you do not have anything there. It is now empty because you went ahead and transferred it over to your USB drive here. Go ahead and open it, open up Fire Stick and you can see it right there. So that's how you transfer. So there are certain applications where you can download things like Morpheus, Terrarium TV, uh, there's a Cinema HD, there's a plethora of movie, uh, apps or TV show apps or even games that you can download to your device and now you can go ahead and put it on a thumb drive. It just really, really increases your storage capacity on your Amazon Fire Stick. In this case, uh, I went down just a little bit. There wasn't too much to that app on the internal storage, but so if you download a movie, it's gonna really take up a lot of your space and your USB drive there, as you can see, just went up a little bit, but we got plenty, plenty of space. Again, you can use a bigger drive if you want to. 
A couple little disclaimers. Uh, there are some thumb drives that are not formatted properly. You can look up on the internet how to format it properly for a OTG adapter. Uh, most of the new ones will work fine. I plugged in uh, four different USB devices to it. Three of the four worked. The other one, I had to plug into my computer, reformat it, and then it plugged in just fine. Fine. So anyways, I just wanted to share this with you guys on how to increase the storage on your Amazon Fire Stick or Fire TV Cube. Hey, thanks for watching our video. I hope you learned something today. And uh, just a reminder to hit that thumbs up. And also guys, I just want you to know, for those of you that stayed to the end of this video, a little bonus for you. I'm going to be giving away one of those OTG adapters to one lucky person. Just comment down below. Say me, 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 something like that. And I will, uh, just something nice about the video if you want to, and we will be giving away a free cable. Now, if you don't win or you can't wait till the end of the month for this cable, go ahead and hit that link in the description. I'll put a link directly to this on Amazon so you can get one of these as well to increase storage on your Amazon Fire Stick. Hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye. Thank you.